What's up guys? So yeah, judging by the background, I'm not in my room. I am in my living room and that's because, well, it gets dark very quick now and there's no good lighting and well, yeah, so my living room it is because it's really dark in my room. Like it's pitch black outside. Wait, yes, I'm wearing pajamas. Do not judge. But like it's pitch black outside. So yeah, I'm filming in my living room. So in today's video, I'm going to be doing some Netflix recommendations. Don't know what I just did there, but yeah. So I did a the So I already did one of these on my channel, like, I don't know when, but I did. And well, since then I've a lot watched, watched a lot more Netflix. So I'm going to be giving you guys some recommendations. So yeah. Without further ado, if you enjoy this video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below. And yeah, let's go. There's a Dylan coming in, guys. Say hi. Oh! Hi, guys. Hey. So yeah, let's get on with the video. Are you just gonna be in the background? <laughs> Taki taki, taki taki oompa. <laughs> so for my first Netflix recommendation, it is Peppa Pig. Okay, no, not Peppa Pig, but it is Sherlock. So I'm pretty sure you guys have heard of Sherlock Holmes. And this is basically a modern day version of that and is like the best show ever. Like it's just mind blowing. Cause like I was watching it and it's just like, how does he even figure half the stuff out? Number two is Rain. So Rain is probably not for everyone, but it's kind of all about setting the past. It's like my words don't make sense anymore. And it's kind of all about Queen Mary. And she's like in France and there's like a lot of murder and like, you know, relationships happening and stuff. And it's all a bit of a teenage drama set back in that time, which I don't know what time, and I did history, and then this is just when I realized that my life is just, yeah. Number three is White Collar. So I watched this one quite a while back, and it's basically this guy, he's a con artist, and oh my days, guys, it's actually insane. So like, he breaks himself out of prison, and then this whole like crazy journey starts, and then he ends up like, working with the police and all this, oh my God, and the ending of it was just like, Oh, mind blown. Honestly, whoa, I need to rewatch that now. Oh my god, yes! Number four, well, that's eight, but number four is Jessica Jones. So it's Marvel. So for all you Marvel fans out there, this is a good show to watch. Number five is Line of Duty. So, oh my days. Okay, I haven't finished this one yet. Let's get comfy up in here. So, I haven't finished this one yet, but I'm like currently watching it, and oh my days, guys, it is the best. Like, it's like police corruption and just like drama and it's just like insane. Number six is The Good Place. This is number six, right? Yeah. Number six is The Good Place. So there's currently a new season. I'm not really liking this new season at the moment, but don't let that put you off because all the seasons before that are like, bruh. That's not even worse. It's a heaven and hell basically. So it's basically about the afterlife and you know, they're dead and then it gets a little cray cray up in there because there's some crazy twists, so you should definitely go watch that. Number seven is Dynasty. So I'm pretty sure a lot of you have heard of Dynasty. And if you haven't watched it, what are you doing with your life? That's the same for all these shows. If you haven't watched any of them, what are you doing with your life? But yeah, so Dynasty is all about this like super rich family and they've got a lot of like drama and secrets and all that happening up in there. Number eight is Once Upon a Time. So Once Upon a Time is like all fairy tales. It's just like mushed into one and it's like modern day and it's like crazy. It's like, so yeah, I keep saying so like, oh my days, I need help. It sounds really cliche, but it really isn't. Like once you start watching it, it is so, so good. So I should definitely watch that. Number whatever this is. Um, so this is Shadowhunters. Oh my God, guys. So I started watching this show and then immediately had to go and buy the books because it is just that good. Because, oh my God, it's actually insane. 
so it's kind of like supernatural and like shadow hunters are like these people who have special weapons to like kill all these supernatural beings and it's just like insane it's so cool so definitely recommend so number 12 is teen wolf so if you like vampire diaries the originals all kind of shows like that you will definitely love teen wolf oh my god guys i binge watch all seven series or was it six however many series i binge watched the entire thing oh my god guys it was insane i absolutely love teen wolf so um number 13 i think this is is santa San santa clarita's diet so this one is a little bit gross a little bit cray cray a little bit everything just all mixed into one lovely little show so basically this girl uh she has like a family whatever but um she weirdly turns into this dodgy thing that eats humans for a living oh my god so like this next one is like so funny and it's just like it's just such like a cool light-hearted show to watch so it's don't trust the in apartment 23 so yeah you guys should watch it's like it's just so like funny and like her as a character like the main girl everything you want to be in life like she's sassy she is fierce she doesn't give a crap what people think but yeah i just love her and it's great so you guys should watch it um so whatever number this is now prison break oh my god so Prison Break, honestly, is probably one of the best shows I've watched. Like I've said, all these shows are amazing, but Prison Break <laughs> is next level. So Prison Break, oh my god, I've rewatched this show like three times. <laughs> is the best. Like the first season is the best season of all time. Like when you first watch it, you're literally gonna be mind blown. You're gonna be like, oh, what the actual hell just happened? But it's so good. So basically, um, quick overline, over, overline, over story, whatever. Summary. It's in the name. Prison break. It's all about breaking out of prison. But yeah, it is so so good. Like, guys, if you're ever gonna watch a TV show, watch Prison Break. Honestly. But yeah. Honestly, Netflix need to sponsor me after this because I watch so much that I'm like, Netflix, please sponsor me. But yeah. So. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below. And yeah, I will see you guys all next time. Bye.